Sunday 29th of September 2024. The Bronze Snake. However, before I come to that, I've taken this opportunity to add this song, which is Talking to Jesus by Brandon Lake and Elevation Worship. Uh, I've taken the opportunity to add it to my Christian music playlist. In doing so, for it is deeply moving for those who are receptive to being moved by the Spirit, I also share with you a nugget of hours of biblical reflection this week, which brings me to the bronze snake. There is too much to bring together today. But my journey of making a concord, as it were, of the scriptures, I put together Solomon's prayer of dedication in 1 Kings 8, 22-53, which repeatedly asks the Lord to hear and respond whenever anyone turns to the temple. With the bronze snake of Numbers 21, where, if they were bitten by the snakes God sent because of their insolence, to look at the bronze snake would save their lives. And 1 Corinthians 10, 9, where Paul says not to test the Lord, as some of them did, and were killed by snakes. This is all a foreshadowing of Christ, of course, who became and remains the temple, in whom we pray to the Father and receive whatever we have asked of him. The point of interest to me was that the bronze snake did not diminish the guilt of their insolence, but that those who trusted to obey by looking at the bronze snake were graciously spared the death they deserved. This is Christ, Christ and Christ from beginning to end. It is the Father's promise that all who seek him, gaze upon him, obey him and pray in him shall have eternal unity with him in the Father's embrace. Forgiven of all sins, past and future, our Advocate and High Priest is the perfect atonement for every single child of God in whom there is now no condemnation. We are the righteousness of God in Christ, shapen in Christ, not in Adam. The righteousness of God in Christ, whatever our failings, and his righteousness is accredited to us by faith. That is all, faith in Jesus Christ, the Son and Saviour. If we sin after regeneration, our faithful high priest calls us to repentance, which is heard and accepted by the Father. So as the Apostle Paul said, let no one despise you. So the bronze snake teaches us that looking at the snake did not spare you from the insolence that brought death. You had to be bitten for your offence to be God to be made known to you. And many died because they were bitten. Those who believed were saved. I hope you enjoy studying the scriptures that I have put before you, for they are all interrelated, and I hope you enjoy the song. May God bless you. Amen. <laughs>